I don't know what to use. I'm gonna use this frog. I ain't caught anything on a frog. I'm gonna use a frog. It's gonna rain soon, so we're going frog fishing today. What is up, guys? We got bass and coffee right there. What's up, guys? We're gonna try to catch the most amount of fish out of this pond. Yeah. It's uh, was it 6:30 right now? Six. Was it? Six fifteen. Six fifteen. There's a storm coming our way. Uh, we'll try and fish before the storm hits. Uh, bass and coffee versus me, King Bassin. Fishing before the storm. Yeah. Let's go. Got King Bassin right there. Let's start the show. We are at a private pond right now. Subdivision. Going to try to catch us. Giant. All right, guys, we got to go in the thick stuff. Uh, Hi. Pool? The pool is straight up that way. Okay. Yeah, up this road and on the right. All right, thank you. Yep. Oh, shoot. I just had a blow up. Come on. Alright guys, got a shaky head tied on. Let's see if we can get a bite right here. Oh, he took my bait, dude. He took my bait. Fish took my bait right on the drop. All right, Let's try to get that fish again. I got him, dude. I got a fish. I got a fish. I got a fish. I got a fish, guys. There's a fish right here. Yes. First fish. He freaking slammed it. He took off with the bait. Oh, look at that. There we go. On the shaky head. Let's get a release on this sucker. First fish down. Let's try to catch another one before King Bassin catches more. I don't think he's caught one yet. I caught it on this UV tight lines bait. It's like a beaver style bait, but with a little twist to it. It's got a skirt inside the plastic. I couldn't rig it on the uh, screw lock because of the tip it was like loose. So I just tied it in like this. Let's see if I can catch another one here. Where you find one bass, you'll find another one. There's another one right there. Second fish, guys. Second fish of the day. Oh, okay, chill. Second fish, guys. On the good old, good old bait. Find fish, you'll find another one. There goes a quick fish. Here we go, guys. Let's get the release. Oh, there it goes. All right, guys. Tip of the day. If you guys are wondering why I fished this right here, it's because there's a little waterfall of cold water going into this little, little pond. And that's where the fish are gonna be. All right, guys, let's go over to the next pond. See what King Bassin's doing. Oh 
Oh shoot, dude, it's a toad. It is a toad, son. Get it in here. First cast into the new pond. Oh man, look at that, guys. On the same, right. same tight lines UV bait. Let's get the release on this person, this fish. <laughs> nice little chunk. Skinny though. Look at that, skinny. There you go. Dan almost pulled my rod in the water. <laughs> this is all I'm doing. It's just Texas rigging it on a shaky head though. Cause it can't screw back on. All right, guys, gonna switch this little bait out. I think it's done. It is done for. Let's see what else I got. I mean, I can use this. This looks good. Probably need something smaller. We'll go with a micro jig. This will do. Let's tie one of these micro jigs on. Mind you that I am using fluorocarbon line. I think it's like 10 pound line. There's another one. Another one, guys. Fourth fish of the day. On the jig that I just tied on. It's just a couple casts and bam. Bass patrol jig. Catches bass. See ya. Let's get a release. Ooh. Awesome. I want to thank that guy for letting us fish here. He's the man. Sorry, I have not been posting for a while. Just been skunked all the time. Just getting skunked on every trip so I don't have anything to post. Usually there's fish in this weed line. Damn, I wish I had braid. Got him, dude. I got another one. Holy crap. There he is. They're all cookie cutters, but damn. Fun to catch. On that same jig, Bass Patrol jig. Don't know what count that is. I think that's the fifth one. Got him right under that, where it's supposed to be. Let's get Snapchat first. If you guys want to follow me on Snapchat, it'll be linked in the description below. All right, let's get the release. There you go. Another fish. Cut that in the deep, yo. Oh. Another one. Where you going? He up there. Oh, he was in the deep spot. Look at that hump. Look at that hump, dude. I'm not even holding it. Look at that hump, guys. It's like a hump back well. Let's get the release. him out there. Six fish of the day guys. Killing it with this jig. Bass patrol jig and that shaky head one I got. The uh, UV tight lines. It's killing it. 
I'm using a medium St. Croix rod. It's a 6 8 medium power, extra fast. And I'm pairing it off with the Assassin by Cast King. Great combo. If you're looking for an inexpensive combo, this is it. I think it's less than 150 bucks. The rod was 100 and this reel was like 60 bucks. But it's a good 60 bucks spent. Getting a lot of mosquito bites. Should have got the bug spray. We don't have anything. Tied another jig on. fishing in any kind of these ponds that have like fountains on them, fish those because that's where the oxygen is in the water. Oh, there's one dude. He's got it. He's got it. Alright guys, meet you guys back at the crib. What's up guys? I'm finally back home after that fishing. It's pretty hot outside. Just took a shower. And now we're gonna get down to the nitty gritty of picking a winner for the giveaway a couple of weeks ago. Right now I'm eating some beef jerky because I'm starving. But uh, I got the comment randomizer picked out into a YouTube video. Load comments. See how much comments there is. 135 unique users. We're gonna randomly pick a winner. And congratulations. Whoever wins, the winner is uh, Chris Mata. Chris Mata, you are the winner. Hold up. There we go. Chris Mata, you are the winner. Send me a DM either on Instagram or on here, and I'll send you the prizes that you won. All right, guys. Thank you guys for watching. If you like that poster, hit that like button. I'll see you guys next time on Bass and Coffee. Keep fishing forward.